Ark sends as many materials for recycling and reuse as possible. Any leftover waste is used for electricity and heat at Amhar Bakke. As with the other incineration processes, CO2 is emitted from Amhar Bakke. Yet there could be good news for the climate. It's possible to capture almost all CO2 in the flue gas we emit using so-called CO2 capture. Therefore, we are now building Denmark's first demonstration plant to capture CO2 at Amabag and convert it into liquid form. From 2023, the demonstration plant will be able to convert 4 tons of CO2 per day. The liquid CO2 can be used to soften water or for the production of carbonated drinks. Normally, CO2 capture involves major heat loss. The surplus heat from Amabag can be used for district heating. The plan is to build a full-scale plant able to capture almost all CO2 from Amabag. We could capture 500,000 tons of CO2 annually. It's equivalent to over 2% of Denmark's entire ambitious climate goal. Also the amount of CO2 removal achieved if Bornholm was covered with tree. But we won't stop there. The liquid CO2 can be safely returned to the subsoil where it can be stored without damaging the atmosphere. It will be possible to use liquid CO2 to produce such items as synthetic fuels, power to X, to potentially replace oil in the future.